The GB Under 20s flew out to the European Championships in Crete this week as they tried to build upon last year's historic campaign that culminated in promotion to Division A. Head coach Doug Leishner is back, along with assistant James Veer and new addition Andreas Kapoulis, but things are vastly different to last year, with funding having been withdrawn from UK sport, leading to a much shortened preparation period. That hasn't been the only challenge the team has faced, with injuries causing the squad to lose a number of players, other players unavailable completely due to college and club commitments, and some being forced to join camp late. The squad has competed in two tournaments, one in France and one in Spain, going 2-4, and four, picking up wins against USA Select Squad and Belarus, but suffering heavy losses to the likes of Spain and Israel. On their return to camp in Essex, they were joined by four late additions, UC Irvine backcourt Alex Young and Luke Nelson, Ben Lawson and Joe Junior Vazolo, four likely starters essentially giving the team one week preparation time before the Euros. Despite this, they feel they are coming together quickly. We've got a good set of guys here, you know, we had a couple bumps in the road, getting stuck in France for like a day or two. Um, we've got that, we're trying to get a team together, like in the sense of we ain't really played together for that long, you know, funding and all that getting cut. It's been tough, uh, especially with being a shorter camp. We went into France, maybe not quite as prepared as we could have been, but the games were really good, it helped us a lot, and then into Spain as well, we stepped up again, and then this week has been really good, we got the new players in, we're starting to shape up nicely, so it's looking good for the tournament. As a team, we've made leaps and bounds of improvement from the first game uh, against uh, Israel, we struggled, but then obviously our last game against USA and Belarus, we played well, so we're continuously making improvements. Hey, I love playing with these guys, uh, you know, they've welcomed me in, and I just feel comfortable now playing with these guys and feeling out how they play, but, you know, it's, I'm enjoying each and every one of them, and I feel like we got a lot of talent on this team. The preparation has been a good challenge. Uh, going to France, going to Spain, we haven't had all our players in. So um, those were a challenging time for us, but I think we got better. Some of the guys were put in roles that may be a bigger role than what they may have in European Championships. So that was a good test. Now we've been in camp here in Essex, and that has helped us. We've added basically four new players, um, and that again has changed roles, has defined things, and we've really come together this last week, and um, looking forward to the championship. They took on the England under-18s in a closed-door scrimmage on Saturday, winning comfortably, and although they know the levels of competition will be a lot higher in Crete, they are relishing going in as underdogs. I, I kind of feel like teams are going to sleep on us, so we can kind of use that to our advantage, you know, come out and be aggressive like we do have like with England all these years, just keep, keep that up. I love being the underdog, it's, uh, it's a great challenge and you can just you, you do the unexpected, so it'll be good. Um, I mean, we've come leaps and bounds, and I think we can really stick it to the teams. You know, we're the underdog, definitely the underdog, and that I wouldn't have it any any other way because we've got nothing to lose, and we're going to play tough, and we're going to leave it all on the table. And once again, head coach Doug Leishner has his sights set high and refuses to settle for anything less. Our goal is to win the European Championships until it's no longer an option. We have to have a vision, and we have to dream. And with our talent, you have to do it. All right, and I believe that. Now, again, we're going against some big, big countries, your France, Spain, and Greece. But to come in and say, I want to finish seventh, or we want to finish as a group ninth or tenth, again, my mentality, I can't comprehend that. So our goal is to win until it's no longer an option.